How old are you both? <laughs> and I seen Angel's sister. She's her. And as soon as I seen her, I was like, bro, Nene. She bad as fuck. Do you actually want him or is it for entertainment? Do it. Come on, do a drum roll. Are y'all together? By the title of this video, we're gonna do a QA with the lovely Infinity. I'm gonna go ahead and let her introduce herself to the channel because she didn't really do that much introducing, but she's gonna go ahead and do it right now, man. She a lot shy, so you're gonna see what happens, man. But go ahead and introduce What's yourself. up, y'all? It's Life with Infinity B. Make sure you guys subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram. Yeah, Cersei, man. I'm gonna have everything up right there. Hopefully, I'll put that right there. We're gonna see, man. I don't know. I, I'm still trying to work on that. I'm on Final Cut Pro, no cap, but yeah, um, you guys ask a lot of questions uh, on Instagram and everything. So pretty much we're gonna go down a whole list of questions you guys wanna know. And yeah, so we got 10 questions each and we're gonna ask those back and forth while eating. You already know, man, my favorite food in the world, seafood, you feel me? Bruh, stop playing, you know this good, man. So yeah, um. If y'all see this bag right now, y'all gonna be joked up. This is an L bag, bro. I only have a snow crab. I thought I was getting a snow crab platter with like shrimp, crawfish, all that. But nah, I'm definitely gonna eat some of her shrimp though. No, you're not. Alright, come on, let's do it. Alright. You wanna start off since you're the guest? You feel me? Mmm. Alright, I'm gonna start off. So, my first question is if your ex, if one of your exes was to call you, call you how would you react? Was to call me? Yeah. Uh, I probably wouldn't answer. My ex, uh, I'm not even gonna say what she did, but yeah. Me and my ex don't uh, talk anymore. For sure. Uh, first question on the list is how old are you both? <laughs> How old are you both is the first question on Bro, y'all about to blow me. Like, you feel me? So, uh, I'm 19. I turned 19 January 9th. Go ahead and let her answer now. I'm none of y'all business age. Oh, okay. Like how you coming and everything. I like how you coming. So, we're going to leave that. that. What's up? All right. Yeah. So, next. Um... <laughs> Bro, look at this one. Bro, oh my god. All right, nah, nah, actually, we're gonna get into this then. We're gonna get into this. All right, so look. Everybody always talk about that I'm so young and stuff like that. You feel me and all that. But like, really, my priorities is straight. Like, I got my priorities set together. Like, I, I know my life plan, like what I got going in life. So, y'all looking at me like I'm a, I'm a young buck, but really, like, nah, it's not that at all. My age is setting me down to a way lower standards, but I got bills to pay, believe it or not. Like, I got my car to make sure I'm, I gotta make sure my daughter's straight. Like, I got a lot of responsibilities that I already have to deal with. My mindset has already, like, went into a whole nother verse. I know y'all probably see me being goofy all the time and stuff like that, but I still gotta handle real life stuff all the time that you guys don't see on camera. I don't show you all the time. So you feel me? Age is not really a big thing to me because I'm just, I'm knowing like, I fuck with her energy and stuff. So it's really just a person. I don't look at her. Yeah. So I don't know. Just show out the age. It don't matter to us. Yeah, you feel me? But, all right, so my question is, someone asked, they say, how did y'all meet? And why, <laughs> why do y'all think y'all the right, like, well, y'all are right for each other? And you stole, oof. All Two right. of them? You gotta get something. Literally, all right, so I'm gonna let you go first since I went first on the last one. Mm -mm, you got it, I'm gonna ask you this. I'm gonna ask you, bro. I'm gonna ask you first. Oh. I'm about, yeah. You feel me? I'm asking, go. All right, okay, so we met actually whenever I went to Miami for your birthday, actually. Like, her sister told me come out and everything, celebrate your birthday with them, stuff like that. And yeah, so I went there and everything, started celebrating it. And that's pretty much how we met. Like, I, after that, like, I texted her and we started building up a conversation and stuff like that. Then I asked for a number, or I think I, I gave you my number. And then, so you said, I think I'm, I wanted to. But I gotta go back and message and everything, but. He was scared, yo. Yeah, was I, was, scared. I, was, I, was, I was shocked. I was shocked to say that, but. You had your reasoning why I was scared. To, she know why I was scared to talk to her. If you're gonna be saying scared to talk to her. I don't know why. A little player, player. Player, player. Gotta go there. Player, player. Okay. Um, yes, we met on a boat. When, we, my, when me and my sister, we did like a trip for my birthday. And we went to Miami. And she invited these two fools on a trip. And that's when I met him. That's when I first met him. But we didn't start talking to like, I'm gonna say like two, Two weeks after it, we started like actually like yeah. talking, talking. Yeah. Cause y'all, like I told y'all, he was nervous. 
Um, I think he's right for me. I wasn't, all right, let me say this. I was not nervous. Literally, I just know my boundaries. Like, you feel me? Yeah, that, I wasn't definitely not nervous. I know my boundaries. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, but. It's a big one. That, that's a, dang. That's real big for a crawfish. I wish I had some crawfish. You guys don't mind. Ooh, you being so sweet. I like Get something the reason why I think he's right for me is because I feel like he got a head on his shoulder. Like, I would say boys I've talked to in the past, like older, wise, way more immature, way more, like they just don't know what they want out of life. They don't know what they doing with themselves. Him, mm -hmm. he don't even act his age, honestly. Like, everybody be saying like that. Childish I swear everybody be saying that. You know, all the other stuff, no. But he know what he want. He a gentleman. He is. Man, I'm not about to give up. Thank you. All right, that's enough. Y'all, y'all get the picture. All right, so look, um, the reason I'm gonna say is like I want to talk to her and everything is because like I see she's very independent, like, and she be helping out a lot. Like it be the little things that matter. Like today we was in the gas station, and everything. I'm, I'm gonna bring this up. Uh, like we was, I, I thought I was gonna just pay for everything. You feel me? We got like a buttload of snacks, like for everyone. So I'm, I'm, I went back to go grab a drink and everything. I'm coming back to the front. I'm gonna whip out my money. She already got a fifty handed out to the cashier. You feel me? So I'm over here like just seeing things like that. Like I ain't never had no female who just step out of the character and just be like, I'm gonna pay for this to go half half on that. Like I was always the one doing something. And yeah, that's just like she showed me a lot of independence. She know what she want. Like she in school. You feel me? Like trying to get major in something really good. Like all that. So. She got a good head on her shoulders too. Mm. Definitely can push me to my limit too in the gym. I need that. Yeah. yeah. We gotta get him up there, y'all. I don't know. I don't know what's going on in that last video that he posted. Mm. Stop playing because you was, first of all, she was cheating me because my leg was way closer than what it was supposed to be. Bruh. No cap. It was, it was supposed to be all the way out here when I started. So that's already one. And second of all, you do tread. Yeah. What that mean? You be actually comments. working. You be actually working. You feel me? Y'all in the comments saying I do tread. What does that mean? He used to play basketball and football. Come on now. Used to. It don't matter. You still do. You still work out and stuff like that. I don't. He still work out. He just stopped. Man, come on. We can answer next week. What are some life goals y'all want to accomplish? Like together? No, nah, I think it's like Separate. individual. Yeah, it's like. Mm. Life goal I want to accomplish is. Mm. It's full place. Me yeah. personally, uh, mm, life goals. Uh, I'm gonna buy my daughter a car at 16. That's always something I wanted as a child when I was 16. No cap. Uh, and I just want to be like financially stable for the rest of my life. Like I'm already good and it's like going in the right path. But like pretty much, um, I want to go back to high school to get my GED. Like even though that's not like something I really think I need. I think that that would just like help just make my family look better and like us as a group more so education and everything because all my family graduated from high school at least. So I was the only one that didn't graduate from high school, but I was so smart though. Like everybody tell me I could have graduated. Like I just literally had a couple months left, but I was just so involved with being a dad and just trying to watch Bella all the time. Like I literally just stopped going to school and stuff like that. So I post on YouTube more, all that. Man, so yeah, I definitely want to start getting back to that. I want to also get back into uh, doing like rec league basketball just here and there for fun. All right, so one thing I do want to get into, I always say like I want to be like this model. So I feel like I want to get like more serious when it yeah. comes down to stuff like that because I feel like I've been playing around a lot lately. So once I graduate, I feel like I'm going to reach out to like different um, agents and stuff like that and see like how to start. I'm going to hold you to that too. You better do that while you're playing. <sighs> Yes, I'm, I'm to going to do that. Um, another thing is like graduating college, which I'm about to graduate in May. I'm super excited about. Facts. And I know my mom is proud of me also. Shout out to her, because mm -hmm. you know, without her. You excited to graduate from college? Yes. All that school. Like that. Yeah. I've been in school for five years. Because I did the extra, okay. but yeah. Okay, then. Where do you see yourself in five years? Why is he asking two questions back to back like it wasn't my turn? Oh, okay, my bad. Damn, but we still gonna answer my question right now since I just went ahead and did that. Let's do it. I see myself <clears throat> living my best life, mm -hmm. financially stable, um, traveling with the love of my life, whoever that may be. Um, yes, so that's why I see myself in the next five years. Like, just being happy. All right, so five years. I'm gonna say, uh... 
I'm, I'm gonna say I'm definitely traveling a lot. You feel me? Uh, I want to start taking my daughter on more trips because she's gonna be older, so I want to start traveling with her a lot more. Um, and I see like a lot of um, mm -mm, just. <laughs> I'm gonna say something, but yeah, nah, I'm just traveling, man. Just traveling, you feel me? All right, my question is Are you guys catching feelings for each other? Go first. You go first. Go first. Man, I ain't gonna lie. Gentlemen first. Gentlemen first. Are we catching feelings for each other? I already caught feelings for her. Bro, you. Oh! No, I don't have feelings for him. Man, that's messed up. Say, I just playing. I do. Yes. Um, I feel like over the time since we've been. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like over the time since we've been talking, like we've grown up bond with each other. Yeah. So okay. that's why I feel like we started catching feelings. Then once I came out here to see my sister and, and my family, he was out here also. So I was like, you know, mm -hmm. vibe together Type. there. Nothing fake, all that shit. But yeah, let me let me uh, tell y'all like I forgot y'all uh, didn't even know about Infinity and everything because I ain't really like bringing to the social media outlet and stuff like that. Like I be trying to chill with bringing certain people to the outlet because y'all be going ham. Like I don't know what y'all y'all be going crazy for no reason. Like real life, y'all gotta know when to like respect my privacy at least. And so when I bring somebody to my platform, it's like respect, and y'all don't be respecting nobody. So I be trying to like hide certain things. But me and Infinity knew each other since like December. Okay, I have another question. So somebody asks, what's one thing y'all like about each other? One thing? Yeah. Um, oh, he quick to answer that, no? What? He was, he was like, ladies first. Oh, uh, okay, I, can, I can answer one thing I like about you. Uh, <gasps> I like that you're independent. Very independent, that's what I'm saying. That's one of the biggest things that like I like about you. I love an independent woman for real. All right. Sure. One thing I like about him, I love how respectable and He's a gentleman. Like, when I first came out here, y'all, I'm not even gonna lie. We had got in the car, he opened the door for me. I was like. For sure, that's, so, that's got to know that, yeah. I had asked Angel, I was like, you know, he do this on the road. And she was like, um, I don't know. And so, like, we had went to the gym and I was like, I got a question for you. And he was like, what's up? I'm like, do you usually like open a door? Or are you just doing it? Cause you know how boys are when they first start talking to girls versus down the line when they already been talking to the for a minute. Mm -hmm. So I just like some of that stuff and don't, you know. So that's why I asked him, but he was like, nah, that's how he grew up and that's what his brother taught him. Yeah, you already know Devron, man, you feel me? Devron's a simple lord, so he taught me that. You so yeah, that's one thing I like about him. Yeah, y'all gotta know that, man. You gotta be a gentleman, you feel me? Um, what made you see a future with Infinity? I guess that's my question there. I put that on there for me, because I'm gonna answer this. A lot of y'all just think, I just be just trying to hop into something when I haven't really been in any relationships for real. Um, but what made me see a, a, a future with Infinity is, first of all, she look amazing. Like, I just want to say that, like, she looks amazing, gorgeous, pretty, cute, adorable, all that. Yeah, you feel me? So she look good. Um, and also, like I just said, her independence, like, she got good hair on her shoulders. The same thing she said about me. Uh, and, like, I just see that, like, she brings something to the table that, like, a lot of girls can't bring. You know? Okay, what was your first impression of me? I think we already did that, didn't we? We did? First impression? Nah, we didn't do first impression. Uh, so first impression, nah, we didn't do that. That's why I skipped over. I thought we did that one. Mm -hmm. So shoot, um, first impression, I was like, you know, I had saw him in Miami first, and I saw him in Nunu, and I was like, hi, nice to meet you guys. I'm in, I'm Infinity, um, Angel's sister, or whatever. So I told Angel, I was like, he's handsome, <laughs> and she was like, uh, yeah. And so we had a little chit chat, a little conversation. So that was my first impression on him, just like, oh, he's handsome. Funny, cool, himself, not trying to be nobody. He's not. You feel me? So always that, man. But uh, my first impression of you, we just was talking about this in the car. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm, we, I'm literally just gonna give you all the real. Like I seen her. Like I'm not gonna cap your boy Mari. So man, how do I wear this? You want some shirt? Uh, yeah, please. How do I wear this? So we pulled up and everything, man. And Nunu was going to see Angel. You feel me? Uh, <laughs> and I seen Angel's sister. She's her. And as soon as I seen her, I was like, bro, Nunu. She bad as fuck. Like, what you want to, you feel? Oh, my bad. What you want me to like say? So I was over here like, I was going crazy just in my head. I'm like, bro, I got to get with her. Like, she she looked too good. And then I just got to vibe with her more after like, you feel me, sex and stuff like that. And she had real cool energy. Like, she wasn't on no like, bougie stuff. Like, she was chilling. Like, I just, I just read her energy already. And we didn't even talk that much. We were just on some, 
da 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 that's my favorite candy. Uh, I'll say my favorite candy is just the red Skittles. That's the one I usually get from the gas station. That's that's good. You already know that. Yo, that's Stop playing. Is your crawfish spicy? No. <laughs> what, you, what you put on your crawfish? Man, I told you I don't like spicy. You see, you trying to set me up. That's what you're trying to do. Yo. You're talking about you want some shrimp and crawfish. You're trying to be all nice and stuff. You know what you're doing. Yo. Man, what type of spice you going at? Yo. That's not my mouth. Mm -mm. Y'all, he don't like spicy stuff, but I totally forgot. <laughs> yeah, drink to drink. Yeah, please give me that. <laughs> how am I even supposed to? You mean, you trying to you Come know. on. Come on, man. Don't be playing, man. Cause for real, I got all this white and stuff. You gonna spill it on me? I feel like a baby doing this. Come on. Yeah, my life. I'm trying to. What's up with you? <laughs> Come on, let's do it. It's good, though, huh? All right. Bro, you gotta put your hair back. Come on. Bro, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? Bro, you might come grab it. I can't, like, I'm trying. Come on, come on. You gotta do it for real. Bro, you is not that thirsty. It is not that hot. Yes, it was. Toxic traits that you plan to work on or already working on? Toxic traits? What's your toxic trait? Do you have any toxic traits? I ain't peeping on toxic traits. Um, one of my toxic traits is whoa. social media. You cannot fool me when it comes down to social media. So if he doing something sneaky, add me. Add me if he doing something sneaky. Never that. And I stay checking. You know what I be checking. Yeah, she be, yeah, she be on that. I ain't gonna lie. She definitely be on that, for sure. Um, but, I have to work on it because that's like bad. So I mean, yeah. That mean I'll be out here doing no fufu. I'm gonna be on no fufu. Alright. Uh let me see. Um I don't got no talk. Tell me what my toxic trait is. Um it was mm, should I say it? I mean I y'all know what happened. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, say it. Say it. I don't think you know what I'm talking about. I know what you're talking about. When was about to start talking because one of the incidents that I did, which it was my fault, I should never, you know, did it or whatever, but, and he was like, ready to, yo, he deleted our TikTok. Yeah, I'm a, I already knew what you were talking about, yeah. That's definitely a toxic trait I was at work on, like, once I'm like, like, I'll be trying to expect perfectness, so like, once I see something, like, cut, like, I won't be playing no games for real, like, I'll be on some, like, that, but I gotta work on that for real, that is, cause I shouldn't be like that, that's like, Trying to build with somebody, you should like see like both sides. And but then we have a conversation about this, and yeah. you were big on me. Uh uh. But yeah, so but I know it out. I had like a uh, whole train of thought. Sometimes I be a hypocrite at times. You feel me? I'm gonna admit that. I'm gonna admit that. Sometimes I do. I'm gonna admit that. Like I ain't gonna lie. Like sometimes I do be a hypocrite at times, but it's because my feelings like directed towards a person. It, Is, do you actually want him or is it for entertainment? Uh, the question for you, so I'm gonna let you answer that. But uh, I mean, I don't know, I'm gonna let you answer that. Okay, so yes, I wait, do you actually want him or is it anything? Mm, yeah, oh, no, and I it's mean, not for entertainment because I feel like before, like. I didn't know him. Yeah, I, I was just gonna say like, she did. She doesn't know like anything about me. She yeah, like, I didn't know nothing about him. Like when I met him in Florida, Angel was like, they were real popular. They were this. They were that. And I'm like, okay. Like that don't phase me. Like I don't care about all that extra. All that extra don't bother me. Cause I feel like if it did, then the comments that y'all put underneath his post, I feel like that would like bother me. But they don't. I just be like, yeah. I don't care about stuff like that. But no, I actually like genuinely like like him. Like he's really like. A nice person. He cool. He cool. So it's not for entertainment. Entertainment is just a plus. 
Yeah. But, like I just said, man, we knew each other for a little minute. So, like, we've been on FaceTime all the time already. Like, you feel me? So, if she was like me for just in the same, she would have been said, post me, da da da, like, do this. Like, I want to make this vid. But, like, you feel me? She was chilling, vibing out, all that. Yeah, I don't really post, you know, I'm, yeah. that's not me. Y'all know New Orleans, if y'all watching. <laughs> I don't really post boys on my social media, so me posting him is like a big, you know. Girl, you better show me off. You playing? You better, you better show me off. You playing? Nigga. But yeah. Last and final question right here. Y'all ready? Dun dun dun. Can I get a drum roll? You know what I'm asking? What? <laughs> do it. Come on, do a drum roll. Are y'all together? You got that. <laughs> no, you got that. <laughs> you got it. All right, guys. So this is what everybody wanted to know. Y'all see on my Instagram. I made that little post. Uh, definitely with some feelings in that post. You feel me? And Wait, I, what post you made? Remember that uh, that little video collage and then the end showed us kissing. Oh. Mhm. Mm and y'all know I wouldn't post nobody me kissing like. Wouldn't post me full on, you feel me? Kid Mari, Mari so lit would never do that. He would never go on the simp characters unless he's actually dating the person. So pretty much, yes, we are dating. It's my girl now, you feel me? My wife, yeah. We're gonna see where it's go though. We're gonna see where it's go. Oh! Um, oh, so. We're gonna see where this go, man. Better boom, better boom. But I think. I think, I think that's the end of the video. And this crawfish was okay. It yeah. wasn't. It I'm, wasn't not gonna cap. Hot. I'm not gonna cap. This drunk was not. Nah, let me not, cause they watch my video. They're gonna be like, do I have even crawfish here? Alright. So I'm gonna give y'all a cool little seven. Seven. It wasn't I'm that bad. Give y'all a three. Um this Dang, one. Dang, it was that bad? Yeah, it's not hot. It's good, but it's not hot. Like You're tripping. That's how much wrong. Man, she don't want to eat any of this. She thought, that's what that's really she been giving it to me. She probably can't, no, stop doing that. See, you know you got all that spicy stuff. It's not even hot, bro. I don't know that. It's not hot. I'm telling you it's not I hot. I mean, I be eating your crawfish and stuff. So. You been eating my shrimp too. What you mean? <laughs> I been eating none of your shrimp. Uh-huh, bro, look. Oh yeah, that boom. was your shrimp. I'm tripping, I ain't have nothing but uh, crab legs in here. Smoked out. Oh, that's good. Yeah, 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 that's good. <laughs> hey, we also doing a touch my body challenge on her page and everything and also she dropped a smash of facts on her channel too So make sure y'all tune into that because y'all gonna see who really know each other better I really feel like it's me. They were saying I won. No cap. They were saying you won just because you knew I promise you I won that video Just like, because I won? Just because you knew literally they were just in love with you just being new and everything So nah. they want to say you won. Nah, nah. I don't really mess with me. I seen your, I seen your comments talking about you won. I'm like they didn't even not yes. watch the video. I won. So if you literally watch the video and you count. And you counted it? I won. Did you count it? Yes. No, you did not. Guess it was. No, like you did not count. Seven to five. <laughs> I was gonna be blow. You said seven to five? Yes. For real? For real. For real, for real? Like real stuff, I won. I know him better. Like not the cap. <laughs> Day, he never told me how many tattoos was my daddy name. What? How many tattoos did my daddy name? What? How many tattoos and what's my daddy name? Oh. He never told me any of that. Yeah. All right. What's, but my, dad, what's my daddy name? I told you after that. Ronald. It's somewhere the R. It's Donald. Damn. You know what's crazy? You know what's, my mom's boyfriend name is Ronald. Yes. Stepdad. She, yeah. She's like the uh, Ronalds, McDonalds. He's from New Orleans. For real? Yeah. He's about 6'6", six, six, got a bald head, black. You telling me because? Don't play with me. Who is that? Don't play with me, bro. Ball? Don't play with my stepdad. <laughs> she'll get wicked real quick. I <laughs> see <laughs> She'll get real wicked real <laughs> So look, man, that's pretty much the end of the video. You feel me? Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. We got a lot of videos to do. And we're gonna take everything slow, man. It's not gonna be no no crazy wrestling. So y'all chill in the comments, man. We're gonna be just easing into everything. But yeah, uh, this seafood was... Don't do them. Don't do them. Go like this, man. Don't be too rude. You feel me? But yeah, uh, hope y'all enjoyed this banger. We out of here. Uh... Peace. Peace, little boy. <laughs> Bro, look, we should, uh, what? 